Um, so, I, me being the idiot I am, didn't record most of this mission. So basically what happened was, I don't know how far we got into the last episode, I really gotta rewatch it, but short summary, that school we passed when we were heading over there to, um, what should we call it, L Londor? Oh, I'm just an idiot, I can't pronounce that neither. So we're in this area, and what happened was that me and Razan are investigating one of the students here, I believe? He's one of the students, or one of the, the teachers, yeah, I think he's one of the students here, and, um, we basically asked the... The, one of the guards, I'm not sure it was one of the guards, but one of the kids here, or the t not kids, the students here, where so and so went and told her to find. Class is now in session! Anyways, um, so we're gonna go in here real quick, like, and Rosendar should be in here waiting for us. I actually didn't realize that I wasn't recording properly, that was Rosendar right there. So, another player, hello. Right, so we gotta investigate around here and look around for clues. Um, I'm slow. Yeah, 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 okay, I'm just gonna skip through this like always. Real quick, like usual routine. Okay, and this game. Okay, and any more pages? Okay. I'll just actually just I'll just do the old pause, pause, and I'll read that through editing. I actually want to get this video out there fairly quickly. Actually, no, I've read that book before. I don't know why. Yeah. Can't say anything about a lore book, so. That's not nothing new. So those books I've read. It's not like it's raining in here for. Here's a new book. Listen round, I am warning to s wait, what? Warning to sound about the overgrown weeds, and I don't mean to forebode, but that's a little odd. Ode? Ode, ode, odd, ode. Hmm. Anyways, just get me through it. Now the story unfolds upon a painful mold. Made of this one. Is this a poem? I think it is a poem. Which is kind of cool. Right, how do I get. Okay. Cause I'm... Ah, I see. That reminds me, hold on. Um, we are in the non dungeon area, so come on. there we go. And there we go. Here we go. The Siege of the Crystal Tower. Okay, let's give me. Actually, I'm going to read this, I need to. Uh, let's say. Okay. was a long book. Oh boy. Let's 
just gonna do the usual read through this through editing. So if you need to want to read it, pause it if you want to. Shit, I gotta put this in a certain order. Oh boy. Maybe I should have read them. Um. Okay. I think I take this one. Nope. I have a feeling of some notes. This one might be. Oh, okay. I think it might be the. Year 2000. Nope. Oh, no, I'm rock again. There we go. And. Oh. A vanishing bookcase. Raz likes this clever sage. Hmm. My illusion spell. Who, who are you? If. You're the person that's been following me. I that's warn a cool you. Major. I'll, I'll scream. Uh, I knew I wasn't imagining things. I told Imadril that we were being followed. If the head of the College of Sapiarch sent you and told you we got it, the Resolute Diamonds, it must be a serious matter. Something involving the other alliances. Uh, the Daedric Princess, actually. Daedric Princess, you say. As in more than one? That doesn't sound very good. Imadril went to King's Haven, not too far from here. The old ruins. He loves to poke around in that place every chance he gets. But I'm still a bit confused. Uh, Raz will explain things to the pretty Saviar and make sure she returns safely to Lilandril. You go find the one in the ruins. Okay, so I'm gonna do a normal quick cut. So talk to you guys in a second. Uh, didn't really have to go far to school, so literally just right there. So let's see. Yeah. Go ahead, grab this real quick and in a second. There we go. Excuse me. King's Haven Pat. Ooh. Hmm. Okay. That was an interesting dwell. Those floating rocks, rocks back there? What is that? You're the first thing I've encountered that isn't a slavering beast or drooling savage. Begs the question, what you're doing out here? Did that idiot Medze send you? Mm, no, who's Medze? The fool I followed out here. I lost track of him after these wretched goblins stole my pack. Hopefully he can manage not to get himself killed long enough for me to recover our notes. Why are you not so Their research for Medze's recital at the Illumination Academy. I've been transcribing them for weeks. Oh, the goblins toss them all over. Not big readers, I guess. But this tribe is bigger than I thought. Uh, I can recover your notes. What are you? Some sort of saint sent to deliver me from digging through Maluk's squalor? Well, two searchers are better than one. We'll meet near the eastern exit of the Coral Splitter Caves, not too far from safety. Watch yourself. Uh, I can't eat tugs. I could, but I don't know why you'd want to know. You're doing me a favor, so go on and ask. Yep. Officially, scribe. Unofficially, nanny. The man's got all the good sense of a swaddled babe. I've had the thankless task of saving him from himself ever since we arrived from Sentinel. Some epic about the great battles between the High Elves and the Goblins that Medze plans to perform at the Illumination Academy. I'll admit, 
sounded much more intriguing before I had to listen to Medze ramble on about it for weeks. Um, okay. It's either find these notes or start from scratch. And if you just spent the past few weeks fumbling through these crags with Medze, you wouldn't be asking me that. True that. Okay, let's guess we'll go look for these notes then. Well, this place ain't too big, so I guess we'll check it out. I right, see vipers, and all right, so I guess we'll head up here first. So I'll probably do a quick cut while I'm at the notes. So I'll talk to you guys in a second. Okay, so I think the first batch of notes is up here. I'm just going to skim through this when I'm editing again. There we go. Oh, random. Is there a cave down here? Or is it up? It's below. Oh boy, please be... It's not deep. Those are floating rocks. Oh. Baddies. Oh, got ones. There we go. Too short, too short. There we go. So, I'm probably going to edit to where I have all the notes, so talk to you guys in a second again. Okay, so I think we got to head... Where do we got to go? And we got to go back in, I think? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Ah, yes. And there is a sky shard right there, too, if you're looking for one. There's a little bit inside of the cave. It's a bunch of randoms. I'll have them do what they're gonna do. There we go. I don't know how much longer I can hide out here. Give me some good news. I found your notes. That's the last of them. I'm not going to give you some my savior routine, but thanks. This is not how I plan to die. Do me one last favor. It's a small one. Would you deliver those papers to Medze and tell him I quit? Look. I've had enough of Medze. Humming, the whistling, the constant attempts at rhyming. I'm not <laughs> completely heartless. That's everything I catalog on this misbegotten adventure. With it, he can finish his research. Darn, I'll bring the notes to him. Naliana, stay strong. Your salvation is at hand. Though, if you could call out, that would be helpful. He's coming. I'm gone. <laughs> I finally girded myself with the courage of my forefathers. I'm prepared to add my deeds to theirs. Even if it means entering oblivion itself, I will find Naliara. You, uh, haven't <laughs> seen her, have you? Naliara quit? Oh, I suppose I cannot fault her. Capture by vile goblins was simply too much for her delicate spirit. Oh boy. But Without her records of my spontaneous, inspired verse, my recital is doomed. Oh, there you go. Well, that's great. I nearly have everything I need to complete my epic of the war fought between the goblins and high elves here. All that's left is for me to uncover the site of their most pivotal battle. Come, let's make history! Um... Uh... 
I mean, I just assumed since Naliara entrusted you with her notes, you were taking over her duties. You don't want to uncover a once in a lifetime discovery? Oh boy. I have a generous stipend from the Illumination Academy to complete my work. All right. The site is close. I just know it. Dramatic instinct. My antiquated directions said the entrance would be where two falls meet stone. Sounds more like an uncomfortable pratfall than landmark, but my guess is the site is near water. Okay, then. I was hit run by these guys. <laughs> Don't mind me. Ah, oh, it was just right here. Perfect. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. It's actually kind of easy. Most of the I'm going to train very man with every table in the region. A tribe in the region. A table. The valley is of the sea. The proven most. Why do these landlock people? The fruits of their hunting and trapping. These tribes are adapted at capturing. Capturing, yeah. Demon taming, uh, popular, public area. Even though we benefit most from the bartering for their un unrefined ore, being exchanged for the caverns that wait, wait, what? Caverns that went through the hills. The locals don't hold it to high value, and seem to prefer to trade the raw ore for our refined goods. Some kind of trade ledger? Oh, how mundane! It seems like the elves who built this place engaged in deals with goblins. That can't be right, can it? Mm -hmm. Oh boy, I'll just skim through this. I'm just gonna edit, skim through this. Okay. Hmm. This looks like scouting reports. Land surveys, goblin settlements. Why was the water source of such interest to them? And just pause and edit, like always. These look like plans for resettlement. Right. Elven and goblin. They were proposing a land trade with the tribe. <clears throat> it seems the offer was refused. There's not much time left before I present to the Illumination Academy. I have my work cut out for me. Okay. You've That's been crazy. an able guide to heroism, keeping me on the righteous road in the face <laughs> of adversity. <laughs> when I sing of the divine messenger who <sighs> sent me on this path, Know that it's your praises I sing. Oh, I like that. Alrighty then. The time has come for me to unsheath the quill of justice and cut an inky swath through centuries of lies. And probably book passage back to Daggerfall well in advance. <laughs> Even if I'm not bludgeoned off stage by thick volumes, I'm told the Divine Prosecution is very particular about the, uh, uh, verbiage used to present the truth. I'd prefer to receive their critiques by mail. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna head to... no... here... Yes, there we go.
You there! Burn the webs! Quickly! Quickly! Mephala's damn webbing. It's in all my nooks and crannies. Thanks for helping, though. No! Save the Dawn Star Gem! The spider poison, it's spreading fast. Take this, Resolute Diamond. Don't let the Golden Knight's sacrifice be in vain. Then you know we're Tower Sentinels, guardians of the diamond keys that open the Crystal Tower. Please, make sure my diamond remains safe. Mavala, Prince of the Secret Arts. She sought my diamond but also seem very interested in the Golden Knight. I fear she's taken him to the spiral skein. Uh. Tell Hanaya I'm sorry. There you are. The right master needs you back in Arteum immediately. Find him in Kapora Tower as soon as you can. Thank you for returning so promptly. Before we get to other matters, tell me about your search for the Tower Sentinels. Valserin recounted the events at the College of Sapiarchs after she returned with Lathan, but I'm eager to hear your report. Mafala, curse her name! Along with her cohorts, Clavicus Vile and Nocturnal, she corrupted Lathan and threatens all of Nern. But the Sapiarchs no longer have an attuned pair of key bearers. That will make it harder to access the Crystal Tower. That Golden Knight is one of Meridia's champions, I believe. It seems that one Daedric Prince is trying to help us. That gem is the Dawn Star, from the Dawnbreaker Sword. Why take the Knight prisoner, though? What are the Princes playing at here? Hmm? Oh, yes. Without two attuned tower sentinels, the Sapiarchs can't use the diamond keys to open the way to the Crystal Tower. The attuning process usually takes a year and a day, and I have no idea if they can hasten the process. It involves my missing memories. I've recalled an important detail, and I need to show it to you. For now, let me compensate you for your efforts so far. I appreciate your help in all this. While you were gone, I have been scrying through my own memories, trying to find the missing events that will remind me where I hid the heart of transparent law. I believe I have discovered something significant. Not exactly. While scrying through my memories, I saw half-formed thoughts and splintered recollections. I saw myself enter the Dreaming Cave beneath Kapora Tower, and I held the heart of transparent law in my hands. I opened a portal, but I can't recall where it went. Something intentionally blocked the destination from my sight. I entered the portal, and time passed. Then I was back in the cave, and the heart was gone. Will you accompany me to the Dreaming Cave? The answer to where I hid the Heart of Transparent Law resides in the Dreaming Cave. Or, more precisely, through the portal I opened and once traversed, but therein lies the problem. It's best if I showed you. Meet me in the cave beneath this tower. <laughs> 